Modern Family is one of the most iconic sitcoms of all time and it is considered to be one of the best. I myself am not much of a sitcoms person but enough Instagram reels and YouTube shorts of Modern Family clips had me excited enough to give it a try. So I did and I did have a good time. I have watched just 3 sitcoms in my life including this one and this show has given me my most favorite character in the form of Jay Pritchett. my comfort character in the form of Phil Dunphy and also my most hated character in the form of Haley the way this show is able to depict the story of a very unusual type of family is impeccable for me a comedy show is not supposed to make you laugh out loud with every single joke the comedy in this show is witty and entertaining to watch for the most part that is In the later seasons most of the comedy is basically a misunderstanding that can be cleared with just one sentence or even one word but it seems to go on for an eternity In sitcoms like The Office and Modern Family as the seasons go on the characters progressively get r- ridiculous they do quite immature and often irritating things This is more evident in Modern Family than it is in The Office The adults of the show for some reason become needy and lie to one another which becomes quite annoying a lot of the time. Lying in order to preserve your image is something that can work on a character like Jay as he is the eldest in the family and wants everyone to respect him. But when this comes to Mitch and Cam or even Claire it becomes quite irritating as to what lengths these characters go. Claire starts to become a very very irritating character. All the characters must have a de- defining trait in the show. Jay Pritchett is the patriarch of the family who is adamant with his ways of life but slowly learns the ways of the modern world. Phil Dunphy is a silly goofball who is very pure of heart. Manny is sort of a sophisticated adult trapped in a child's body. Alex is a nerd who finds her own voice throughout the seasons. Luke is the dumb little brother who isn't actually as stupid as everybody thinks he is. Mitchell is the adult dealing with his insecurities because he was in the closet for so long that he hasn't come to terms with his own identity yet. Gloria is a Colombian hustler who has had a rough life but is now finding her new life and new role in this family. As you noticed I have left out three characters Claire, Cameron and Haley. I'm not considering Joe because he isn't around for long enough to have a character arc. And Lily is still very much a kid when the show ends. I have left these three characters because I personally find it hard to see their character traits or arcs and hence these are the characters I find most irritating. Cameron and Claire have their moments that show that these two are actually really good parents. But when it comes to Haley there is very little growth in her throughout the show. despite her being the character with the most relationships and an unplanned fucking pregnancy haley is still immature stupid and annoying the rebellious teen she starts the show as is pretty much all she is throughout the 11 seasons the way haley jumps from guy to guy without having much of an emotional involvement or baggage or without her learning anything becomes annoying quite early on in the show Despite all the problems I have with this show and its characters I still consider Modern Family to be a good watch with some moments that shine and some that don't but the show manages to wrap up its final season in a very very heartwarming and emotional way and I guess it's like they say all's well that ends well thank you